And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. MLB The Show with a good one coming at you. It's the Los Angeles Dodgers and the Chicago Cubs. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Chicago Cubs. Just about to get started, and starting this one, Justin Steele. Well, he comes at hitters with a five-pitch mix, so for him, it's always interesting to see how he utilizes those weapons. He may lean on one or two pitches, depending on how things are going and how things are working, but if he can control four or even five of those offerings, look out, hitters. It's going to be a tough day. He's really going to be able to keep those. Now this one is smoked down the left field line. On its way, but it's fair. Out of here. He made him pay for that one, and they're chipping away. It's Boo, clearly some frustration out there on the mound right now. I mean, that ball was so close to going foul. Would have been a long strike, but instead, batter gets rewarded. Did a nice job of... Sammy Sosa, the next Cub to hit. He's already homered in this game. Oh, Boo, he consistently hits the ball hard. His exit velocity and barrel rate near the tops in the league. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. An absolutely majestic shot. His second home run of the game, it's 5-4. Now he's just showing off out there. And who can blame him with a swing like that? Give that man a bat, watch it go a long way. When you're working with this kind of velocity, so critical that you move the ball around, work quickly, and make sure that you keep that hitter off balance. Clearly not fooled by the location or the velocity. He was all over that fastball. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris the Singleton. Here's the shortstop at the play. Miguel Rojas. Here comes a pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. Sosa makes the catch. Runner tagging for third. And he's in safely at third with one out. Now back. Second baseman. Mookie. J.D. Martinez stands in. J.D. Martinez is the first guy that I remember seeing videotaping his own batting practice so that he could go back inside and look at the video. In the air, right field. Sosa makes the grab, and there's one away. As good as he's seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand, you cannot hang a breaking ball right there. Lucky it stayed in the ballpark. Taylor. So first and second with one man gone. Enrique Hernandez digs in now. Not the easiest thing when you're talking about a guy that's, you know, perhaps is going to be in the rotation, you know, maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, to come into an inning with pressure on it and, and try to get yourself comfortable. Sosa makes the grab, two down. Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, no, but a competitor like him, he is mm. looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. Sammy Sosa, the next cup to hit. Coming off an absolute bomb in his last at bat. If you don't get ahead in the count, you can forget about having any success against him. Hard hit, left side. Throw on to Freeman. 
And that's the first out in the bottom of the fifth. Up next for the Cubs, the first baseman, Patrick Wisdom. Now back. Next to hit, Sammy Sosa. He's got a couple homers already, so can he possibly do it again? Come on, man. Of course he can. Those two he hit were legit, and he looks pretty locked in right now at the dip. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. And that one is out of here. He's done it again. And they boost their lead. It's 10-6. That's their fifth homer of the game. Man, they're all getting into the action. It's starting to feel like a home run derby up here. He's putting on quite the show at the dish here in this one, and he's just so locked in with this swing, and he's just not missing right now. A three-homer game, man, it's so special. And I tell you what, it's a lot of fun watching him pull it off as well. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. Here's Kike Hernandez. And the 0-2. Swing and a high fly ball down the right field line. Sosa makes a nice running catch. One hit in the inning, a solo homer. Midway in inning number seven, and it's time to stretch. It's the Cubbies 10 and the Dodgers 7. Man at first, and next for the Cubs, Sammy Sosa. This is a true five-tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but... When he's on the field, you can't take your eye off of him. And a pitch out, but nothing going on. Fans come to the ballpark to watch him play. And in baseball, to have such a talented player going out there every day and putting on the show that he does, just a joy to watch. The 1-0. This one drilled to left. No doubt about it as they add on more. Gone. A two-run homer, and they throw a pair on the board. It's 13-7. He absolutely crushed that one. No doubt about that one, Boog. We knew it wasn't coming back. Wow, this is awesome. I mean, a four-homer game. They're just so rare. They're so special and just so tough to pull off as well. Everything has to line up for you, but of course, you've got to make it happen, too. And these are the top. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi yeah, and Chris Singleton. Now it's J.D. Martinez. Martinez. Is just one strike away. Next offering popped in the air, right field. He's got it. Ball game. And the Cubs take this one in a blowout. Well, these guys came to the yard today thinking one thing. Launch mode. Six home runs. Just an incredible offensive display today. Even by today's standards, that is a huge total. A 13-7 final score in this one. The Cubs go home a winner for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chambi saying so long.